Full time Arsenal 2, Manchester City, nearly said United. Who knows? It could be United in the final. But it's Arsenal 2, Manchester City 0. What a performance. And if you're not going to back that manager after that kind of performance, you never will. What a performance to a man today. I thought there was no players that will step up in these big games, right? I thought the likes of Sanchez and Ramsey, the ones players that back in 2017 would have taken this game, type of game by the scruff of the neck, but they all proved me wrong. Aubameyang's not a big game player. He proved it tonight, and hopefully he'll prove it in two weeks' time on my 21st birthday in the FA Cup final. I am buzzing. I did not expect that today. Yes, yeah, City, they absorbed, they, you know, were attacking. Very similar to the Liverpool game last week. Uh, not last week, in the week. Two outstanding performances. David Luiz, shout out to him. Granite Shaka. Now, I haven't really mentioned this much in the, these videos, right? And I keep forgetting what a man Granite Shaka is. To come back to where one of my, my famous videos from this season is when I wrote off Granit Xhaka completely after he told the fans to fuck off. But the way this man just controls the midfield, he's a leader in the middle of the park and he's absolutely outstanding. So Bios today, Mustafi today, Louise today, everyone today, to a man was absolutely excellent. We went, Aubameyang missed a key chance at 0-0. Two minutes later, Pepe, Bellerin passes the ball on the right to Pepe. Pepe whips it in, and it's on his on his, on his right foot, I think, which is his weaker foot, I believe, with Aubameyang. You think he's going to take it on his left foot. He takes it on a harder angle on his right, and he slots it away to make it 1-0. And it was on our second attack, really. And all I'm thinking in that second half, City were pressing, pressing, pressing. They were attacking. And all I'm thinking is get to the drinks break. If we get to the drinks break at 1-0, we will win this game. Now, I know drinks break are drinks breaks, right? They're being used as timeouts and tacticals and everything like that, right? We know this. And I knew for a fact if we could hold on to that drinks break, we will win this match. And no less, two minutes later, Tony whips a delightful through ball into Aubameyang, who slots it away comfortably through Edison's legs to make it 2-0, game over. They weren't scoring in the barn door today. We were absolutely outstanding. Like I said, Shaka will have only come on today, full of energy. Lacazette, this possessing balls. The only one I could really would say that didn't play that great was Hector, but he still stayed in the game and played extremely well. I am so proud of this team, and I just hope that we can continue the momentum in the league in the last two games of the season, as well as now they're all playing for the FA Cup final spot. And hell, I might even make a video on that tomorrow because now that's relevant to the arse because whoever wins tomorrow will be playing Arsenal. Personally, I want it to be Manchester United, the two most decorated teams in the competition going head to head. I can't be asked for Chelsea again. I really can't, right? And I really want, at the same time, revenge for Baku last year would be great against Chelsea. Bring either of them on, OK? Because we've just beaten Manchester City, the holders of this competition. I believe they've won it the last two years as well. We can, if we can beat Manchester City, I'm very confident we can beat Man United and Chelsea. But we need to put in exactly the same effort as we did tonight. Outstanding effort. And if you're not convinced by Mikel Arteta, now you are. Because what a manager. If we back this guy, and I even said it on Sky Sports, if we back this guy, we're going places. Fantastic performance to a man. Arteta Masterclass. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I am sweating in this room, but my God, is it worth it. Like for you if you enjoyed. The only, the only bad thing about this today is the fact none of us could be there. But that is what it is, right? 21st birthday, FA Cup final. The Arsenal lifting it. Let's hope. Let me know what your thoughts of the game was in the comments down below. Man of the match has got to be Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang for his two goals against Manchester City. See you guys in the next one.